looky, looky what I got. If you're part of the brace country, you know exactly what this is. backed into a corner see welcome to beyond the box this is going to be an episode of corner collector a special episode because i'm doing something i probably will very rarely do this is a world champion braves replica ring presented by truest um me and my friend. My friend was the one who told me that they were giving this away. And I was like, heck yeah, let's do it. So yeah, this is uh, the replica ring for their 2021 season where they ended up winning the entire thing. Pretty awesome. I said this is probably rare because I'm not really into sports. Um, baseball is really the only thing that I follow. Even that, it's just Braves that I really follow, so yeah, but let's get to it. It's kind of tucked in there. Um, after the game, or the day after, or whatever, um, we, I did find out that they are going to be doing, they are going to be doing it a couple more times. Ooh. But yeah, I was very impressed with with uh, the quality of this. Um, it's just another styrofoam cup, but yeah. Now let's open this. Very, very cool. Um, like I said, uh, I was not expecting this quality, I mean, it's pretty high quality for it being a free giveaway. This is what I'm saying. Let's take this out. Let's take a look. I mean, it's got some weight to it, man. Some serious weight. So, as my format, this is everything that you would get if you were lucky enough to obtain uh, one of these World Champion Replica Rings. Without further ado, let's get beyond the box. Before we get into the lessons learned, I figured I'd show you how this looks on a normal hand. My friend actually unboxed it at the game. I'll do a separate video for that. But here, I, here's how it looks. Unfortunately, as big as the ring was, it still didn't fit my hands. I am ashamed. Anyways, now for the lessons. First lesson will be on the editing side in Premiere. So this lesson I had experienced a little bit already, but this video really 
put an exclamation mark. Time ramps slash motion effects within the same clip. Now I've tried nesting it, it does not work. But basically if you manipulate uh, the time uh, on the clip and if you do any kind of manipulation for motion, the keyframes do not line up. I don't know. I guess it makes sense because you're messing with the way the time works in the clip, but man, it's frustrating. And maybe I'm making a very obvious mistake. That's the point of this channel. Please enlighten me if you know. Shot management, second lesson. Sometimes shots don't line up with the rest of your video and it's best just to scrap them. But I really wanted to show off my signed Chipper Jones baseballs, so there's that. Thank you for watching. I really do appreciate your time. Subscribe if you like any part of this video or if you're a Braves fan. Haha. <laughs> Here's hoping I get to unbox their 2022 championship ring. Until then, let's go get it and let's go Braves.